Writing and recording Lady Postman was an adventure because I had the idea for the song in Hawaii. I booked studio dates in Asheville, North Carolina with my good friend Patrick Armitage on the drums and bassist slash producer Michael Hines in the South. And we wrote the song and we started like playing with these really funky, like more stay in the time, earth, wind and fire type production styles. And then but I really felt like the song was incomplete. I didn't have a lot of money and so therefore my studio time was really kind of short. And what I, what I had from that was kind of more of a shell and um, I needed to finish it and so I went to uh, my producer Andrew Greeson at Moore Sound Studios in upstate New York and that's where we really dug in. We got the horn section from John Brown's body to come in and uh, lay horns over that and we got to like really retune some of the stuff. I really want to give a shout out to Dwayne Simpson who laid the guitar solo on that track in one take. Um, he's an animal. Recording this literally happened all over the globe over a period of a year. So it was really cool. A lot of remote tracking. Hawaii, North Carolina, New York, all in this same song. <laughs> 